Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel and thank you for checking out this video. For our tutorial today, we are going to show you how to propagate grids to other levels or other plan views. But before we start, if you are new to this channel, please don't forget to like, subscribe, click the notification bell and leave a comment down below. Thank you. Propagating grids is very useful when you need to set the grid layout on one view and apply it also to other levels or other similar views. For example in this view, grid 1 and 4 is adjusted to avoid overlapping with grid 2 and 3. If we go to level 2, notice that the grid is not set as what is in level 1. Let's set the scale to 200. Let's do the same for other levels. Let's go back to level 1, and make some adjustment on the grid bubble. On the other levels. Notice that whatever adjustment we have done on level 1 did not affect the grid on other levels. Now we are going to select all the grids on level 1. Then select the Propagate Extents icon on the ribbon. Then the Propagate dialog box pops up. We are going to tick on the views or levels that we want to apply the grid setting that we have done on level 1. Then click OK. Let's go check out other levels and see if the Propagate Extents works. OK. It works. Let's do that one more time. Let's make some changes on the grid once more. Let's tweak this grid. Then we select all the grids again, and click on the Propagate Extents icon. Then tick all the levels that we want to apply the Propagate Extents. Then OK. This is how to propagate grids on similar views to ensure that the setting you have applied to one view can be applied to other views easily. You won't need to keep on repeating the grid setting one by one on every other view which can be very tedious. Alright, that's it for now. You may start using this method in your own project and will help you speed up the process in setting up plan views. Please comment down below if you have any questions or if you have any suggestions of a tutorial that we should do. See you again in our next video. Thank you for watching.